The Argyle Diamond Mine was a diamond mine located in the East Kimberley region in the remote north of Western Australia. Argyle was at times the largest diamond producer in the world by volume, 14 million carats in 2018 although the proportion of gem quality diamonds was low. It was the only known significant source of pink and red diamonds producing over 90% of the world's supply, and additionally provided a large proportion of other naturally colored diamonds, including champagne, cognac and rare blue diamonds. The Argyle Diamond Mine is located in the Kimberley region in the far northeast of the Australian state of Western Australia. 6. It is located to the southwest of Lake Argyle in the Matsu Ranges, about 550 kilometers 340 miles southwest of Darwin. Because it is 185 kilometers 115 miles by road from the nearest settlement Kununora, a complete residential camp was constructed on site. Most of the 520 workers commuted from Perth, over 2,000 kilometers 1,200 miles away, for alternating two-week shifts at the mine. The mine encouraged local employment and had a large number of indigenous local people working within the mine. The mine site covers about 50 hectares 124 acres, stretching in a mostly linear shape about 1,600 meters 5,200 feet long and 150 to 600 meters 490 to 1,970 feet wide. Argyle originally used open pit techniques, reaching about 600 meters deep at its deepest point. The open cut closed in 2010, and operations became fully underground in 2013. Small quantities of alluvially deposited diamonds have been known in Australia since the late 19th century, first found by prospectors searching for gold. However, no source volcanic pipe deposit was apparent. Following the discovery of several alluvial diamonds in the West Kimberley PP region along the Leonard River Ellendale area, in 1969 a systematic search of Western Australia for the source of these diamonds was begun by a consortium of mining companies, collectively known as the Columbaroo Joint Venture. Tanganyika Holdings part of the Columbaroo Joint Venture, later to become the Ashton Joint Venture. The diamonds produced at the Argyle Diamond Mine were of an average low quality. Only 5% of mined diamonds were of gem quality, compared to a worldwide average of 20%. Author Janine Roberts contends that the near-gem quality rating is subjective and misleading because these diamonds can be cut into gems if desired. Of the and thank you for watching my video don't forget to subscribe to my channel.